Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, thank you so much for stopping by. I really appreciate it and I hope that if you like my craziness that occurs here on my channel, you will maybe stick around and at the end just maybe hit that subscribe button and maybe hit the notification bell. But I, you have to wait till the end of the video to see if you like my cuckoo-ness or not. But without further ado, I finally finally got my Sephora play. I got the notification, I'm like, and I'm waiting, and I'm waiting, and I'm waiting, and I finally got home, and it was in the mailbox today, and I was kind of, kind of glad it was, because my makeup held up quite well today on my eyes. I am quite impressed with, with it, that it, it held up, because of course it's a million degrees. You know, you know the deal on this channel. It's always a million degrees. And I'm finally going to open this the correct way. And guess what? I, I brought them reaching over here. I brought scissors. And go around stab things. I don't know if I should go around saying that. But anyway, I'm not going to bore you. I will tell you about the subscription at the end in case those who already have it just really want to get into the box and see what I got. And then at the end, if you're curious about what Sephora Play is, then I'll tell you. Even with my scissor, I can't get into my box. What is wrong with me? Okay, I got it open. Ha uh ha! -huh. It's a pretty little summery card. No, wait, that, yeah, it, I was, that looked like Christmas lights on a mantle for a minute. No, it's not. Please don't rush it. We do get our 50 uh, Sephora Play points, and I have yet to use the freaking thing. I keep forgetting it. And this is going to tell us what we got, but I'm not going to look yet because you know me, I need to be surprised and then you need to be surprised. Here we just have a white canvasy bag with a red ribbon and play by Sephora. Feels a little heavy uh, this time. It is a very generic bag. That's okay. Okay, so the first thing I'm pulling out is a packet. Oh no, please don't let it be a no, half hair foil packet. Okay, it, it, it is a hair foil packet, but it is by Briogeo. I happen to like Briogeo. Um, it's on the expensive side and I have yet to pull the trigger and actually buy a full size of it, but I've gotten several of these. This is the Blow Dry Protection and Heat Protectant Cream. There ain't no blow and dry. Blow and dry? There ain't. Let's try that again, Leanne. I'm gonna be the grandma, please. There isn't any blow <laughs> drying of this hair currently going on in the summertime, and this is not a lot. This won't even cover my hair, but I'm gonna use it anyway, eventually. Just not now. Okay. I'm now pulling out a little tubey thing, not tubey, like lipsticky type thing, and oh, it is very pretty. What are you? I don't have my glasses on, but I like it. Beautiful color. Let me swatch it. It's very soft and creamy, and I have no idea what brand it is. But that is a super, super pretty color, and we're going to try that on at the end. As soon as I find out what it is. Huh. Let's see what else we got in here. I feel a compact thing. And it is a mini Tarte blush. This is in the color, I'm not going to say the way it's written, party. But you know they make it party. I refuse to say it like that, sorry. I do like their blushes. I have quite a few of them. It's a very beautiful wearable blush. I do love these blushes because they're super soft. This is just a beautiful, at least for me, very wearable everyday pink color. I like that. I'm happy with that. And it's a quite the decent size. I'm going to wipe this off my hand so I don't get my little baggie dirty. Going up next, I feel a box. A box usually means a teeny tiny little jar of something. And this is, oh, it's from Biosense. I don't know, I think I've discussed Biosense a couple of times on my channel. And Biosense, from what I've researched and the research I've done so far on certain products, it is an excellent skincare company with very effective, good for you ingredients, no bullcrap. And this is the Squalane and Probiotic Gel Moisturizer. And 
comes in a jar. It has a slight scent to it. It's a very light, clean scent. But it's just your white cream. I'm not going to waste a lot of it. They are very expensive. Uh, the specific uh, eye cream that I want to get and try out is $88 or $78. This is very nice for the summer because it is a gel moisturizer. And I don't think you need very much of it because it is going melting right into my skin so I think this will last me a while and I might even be able to get a good judge of how it works so we'll read up on that as well there's two things left in here and I feel a little dropper thingy it is a little dropper well we got some good brands in this one this is the alginist the genius serum now I have not researched the ingredients on this there was one alginist product that I did try that the, in, the active ingredients were all the way on the bottom, which means they were approximately 1% of the actual product and that makes them virtually ineffective. So I will look this up and this will be going in my favorites in my monthly review, favorites or fails of my monthly review. But I mean, that's quite a decent uh, size for a serum. The last thing is a rather small a box. And what are you? It is from Carez. It's called something, but it's with wild rose oil. Now rose oil, some people dislike the scent of rose, but there is some evidence that rose oil is very beneficial for your skin. Again, there are some skincare ingredients I'm going to be doing much more research on, but this is, we got a lot of little dropper products. I do want to smell this. I said, some people hate the smell of rose oil. It smells. I like it. It smells. You want to know something funny? It smells like red wine. It smells like it smells like wine. I, mean, I just want wine at the moment, but that's what it smells like. It is a very light oil, not a heavy oil. It slips right, right into the skin, smooth right in. That's very nice, and once there is bigger print that I can read, I will show you, I mean rather, I will explain to you what that is. Uh, so we got quite the nice assortment of products. We got one, two, three, we got six products. We did not get the perfume sample. They might have replaced that with the Briogeo. It's a distinct possibility. I gotta get my glasses. I don't want to get my glasses, but I gotta get my glasses. I swear. Every day I get closer to 50, I need this more and more. Oh boy, c'est la vie, well at least I can see now. <laughs> okay, so the first thing we're going to talk about is the clay all day. It says, the theme, by the way, there's a method to that madness. The theme of this month is called Beauty Blends. And it says, good for you ingredients aren't just in your drinks. So I guess that they are promoting good for you ingredients. I'll be the, the determinant. Wait, I, I can't talk today all day at work. I, I, like the aphasia was just, it's ridiculous. Anyway, I will determine whether or not these ingredients are good for us or not. But so this is the Charred Amazonian 12 hour lush in it's party. I'm not saying it that way. Sorry. A Storm Silky Powder Blush in Sephora. Exclusive shade. I did not know that. That's very interesting. That looks flawless for hours. Okay. So the next one is Do D E W, The Bright Thing. And they're talking about the Biosense Squalane and Probiotic Gel Moisturizer. A hydrating gel that uses 100% plant-derived ingredients for brighter, balanced skin. There is something to using plant-derived, um, not animal-based products for skincare. It says that this super light moisturizer calms redness, minimizes the appearance of pores, and improves hydration for a dewy look. And it says that it's fragrance-free, but to me it had a slight scent to it. So they may not have added any ingredients, but probably the plant-based ingredients that are in here do have a natural scent to them. The next thing is Botanical Bounce Back, and they are talking about the Alginist 
Genius Liquid Collagen. I have, that's, this, that's what this is, liquid collagen. I have my own theory upon whether putting collagen on your skin and or ingesting it really has any effects. From the research that I've been doing, I'm tending to say no, but that's another video. A vegan collagen-based serum that visibly restores skin's suppleness and resilience. Naturally sourced um, microalgae oil beads penetrate the skin in an anti-aging formula that visibly reduces the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. Remember, you have to use skincare for a lengthy period of time before you will actually see any difference. And with some of my skincare that I've been using for quite some time, I actually do see a difference. Okay, moving on. Marine Street. This is from Tarte also. Okay, so we got several Tarte products in this one. This is the Color Splash Lipstick Rainforest of the Sea Collection in Salt Life, L-Y-F-E. I happen to really enjoy the Rainforest of the Sea products and I'm in love with this color and can't wait to put it on. Maybe I will just try on the lipstick for you. I'm not gonna try on the blush, but I did swatch it for you. The Ultra Clean clean? Maybe it is clean. The Ultra Creamy Lipstick rain pairs premium pigment with antioxidant rich algae and marine flower extracts. Lips look visibly firmer, fuller, and smoother. I doubt that because you'd have to wear it all day every day, but we'll see. But I love the color. It's gorgeous. Let's try it on. I'm going to just take the lipstick on that I pull off, that I have on. You know, I have to say most Makeup wipes taste really, really awful. Those don't really taste bad. I'm kind of glad about that. Let's try this. It's definitely smooth and creamy. They're not lying. That is a gorgeous color. It's smooth. It's creamy. It goes on effortlessly. And I can see myself wearing this absolutely every freaking day. Love it. Okay, rooted in goodness. Oh no, sea of change first. Okay, so basically this is, as I said, by Caress, and this is Wild Rose Vitamin C um, Active Brightening Oil. Now, okay, here's the thing about vitamin C. Vitamin C is extremely unstable, and so it is gets diminished with air and light. So if there's actually vitamin C in here, it is essentially ineffective because this is a clear jar. And by the way, when vitamin C is best paired with ferulic acid to be its most effective. Let's read this. An ultra concentrated vitamin C face oil that reduces the look of fine lines and wrinkles. This formula superpower is Super C. It provides antioxidant protection against free radicals. Wild rose oil improves the look of fine lines, discoloration, and texture. Okay, I understand about the wild rose oil, as I said, but to me, vitamin C in a clear jar is, is just, you, you may as well be putting just a nice feeling oil on your skin. I have to do some more research into that to see what type of vitamin C, how stable, unstable it is, but vitamin C in skincare in itself is just predictably unstable. But air and light are two no-nos. And last but not least, Rooted in Goodness Briogeo, Briogeo Blow Dry Perfection Heat Protected Cream, a heat protected blow dry cream that boosts hair's luster and softness. Why it's got the goods, a salon like blowout is possible with this weightless formula. It's infused with rose hip, argan, and coconut oils that condition and seal in moisture. Plus it protects strands from UV rays, free radicals, and heat up to 425 degrees. I said I have used these samples of their products before and I really do like them. So essentially the theme of this box was healthy skincare, good for you ingredients, you know my thoughts on that. Just to explain now, I waited till the end so if anyone just want to see what's in my bag, they can click off. But for those of you who don't know and you want to know, Sephora Play is a $10 a month beauty subscription box where you usually get about five to six products. And the good thing is that they are all sold in Sephora so you don't have to go to other sites to hunt around and find the products if they're easy to find and then they give you this bonus of 50 points but you have to bring it in store I, I mostly order online it's very rare that I go in store to Sephora only on occasion and it's only good for a month so they expire so although it's a good idea 
it's it's really difficult to use unless you run right out to Sephora into the store and purchase one of uh, the products or whatever. But I think I am extremely happy with this bag. I like the products very much. I like the sizes that they did give us. I will have to make a determination on whether or not they are beneficial and whether they work. And of course, I will give you my update of these very soon since it's almost the end of the month. You know, I got it so late. But thank you so much for watching. I hope you did enjoy this and I hope you enjoyed my ramblings and I hope you learned a little something about skincare. I have a lot more of that knowledge <laughs> to come. I do promise you. But thanks again. I hope you guys all have an amazing day and amazing week. And if you wouldn't mind giving this little video a little thumbs up, it would really, really mean a lot to me. And by the way, if you stuck around this far, there's a couple of little guys back there hanging out. Those are two little items that I am going to be doing in a random giveaway that is coming up very soon. It's not going to be announced, but for my loyal friends that watch me all the time, you're going to know when it is. So I will see you guys very soon in the next one. Bye!